Hey there, Hooniverse. It's time to get a look at the Hooniverse project car. You might know it as the Wombat because that's what the previous owner called it. Now it's ours, and it is a W123 Mercedes-Benz station wagon with a diesel motor. Now, there it is behind me. That's how it's going to look. It's going to stay that way on the outside mostly. Maybe some wheels. We don't know because those are pretty cool 14-inch wheels. The big news is what we're going to do under that long hood. So what are we dealing with here? Well, this is an inline five-cylinder, three-liter motor, and it was good for about 125 horsepower and around 180 pound-feet of torque. All that torque came on at about 2,400 RPMs, which sounds pretty awesome. Still, these things are not fast. They are notoriously slow. Take the zero to 60 time, it's probably a billion seconds, I think. I, I'm not good at math, but it's around there. So what we're gonna do, and all the Mercedes-Benz purists are gonna hate us for this, we're ripping this engine out. We're ripping that transmission out, the four-speed automatic. And what we're going to put in is a reunite. We're going to reunite Daimler and Chrysler, and we're going to put in a Hemi. So we've got a few challenges ahead of us for this build. Biggest challenge? How the heck do we get that engine and trans in there? Well, we're going to figure that out by hiring someone else to do that because I don't have the skills to do that. So a man or a woman with some engine and fab skills will be on deck next for this car. But we have another challenge because back here, this car is fitted with a self-leveling rear suspension because it's an over-engineered piece of German precision. That is really cool, but it runs off a system that eventually connects to the engine. And since we're taking this engine out, we're gonna have to take that out. But there's a kit on the market that lets you switch for coils and it's not expensive relative to the cost of what the self-leveling suspension kit. To make that work, it'd be a nightmare. So we'll get that covered. We're working on getting that covered. And you're just gonna have to stay tuned for more updates as we build this baby out for the next year.